All right, today we're gonna to learn about cosine. So this is cosine, and on a calculator, in a textbook, on a test, you're gonna see COS, please. Don't say cos, so annoying, okay? See, when you see that, you just say cosine. Cosine of an angle is equal to a ratio. This ratio is adjacent over hypotenuse, okay? So, I have a triangle for you. If we wanna find the cosine of A, it's a ratio. So you put your finger on A, adjacent. Well, both these sides are adjacent, but 17 is the hypotenuse, so it can't be the adjacent. So the adjacent is 8, and the hypotenuse, well, we just said is 17. So the cosine of an angle is equal to the ratio 8 over 17. Now, what if we wanted to find the cosine of angle C? Now my finger's here. Now what's the adjacent? 15. But the hypotenuse hasn't changed. So that's how you can find the ratios. Now we could use that to solve problems, okay? If I'm looking at this, here's the angle I know. So this 18 is the adjacent. The X is the hypotenuse, so that is cosine, adjacent hypotenuse. So I say cosine of 32 degrees is equal to adjacent over hypotenuse, okay? Put this over one, cross multiply, ooh, 30 cosine 32 times x, so you write it x cosine 32 degrees is equal to 18. How do you get x by itself? No big deal, just divide by whatever's attached to it. Both sides divide by cosine of 32, that cancels. So x is about, so now you bust out the calculator again. Okay, here we go. You gotta clear it. So. You just type in what you see. I see an 18, I see divided by, I see cosine, I see 32. Survey says about 21.23. About 21.23. And that, my friends, is how you use cosine.